Kia my viewers, well, you know what's happened, we made it to Tamaki Makoto, the city of smiles, that's right, you've heard of the city of sales, well, I just trademarked the other night, city of smiles, so that's right, we're in the largest city of our country of Aotearoa, New Zealand. So, join me, I haven't got a clue who we're going to meet. I will be interviewing maybe mere hopefuls, MPs, and then the ordinary person on the street. But one thing is for certain, we've got a message. So, hi my everybody, let's go! See where we end up. One of these, but check it out, cuts. <laughs> Kawai Tui Noi, your name? Tracy, Tracy Shackleton. Okay, Tracy. So, what is your role I'm within this area of Papakura? I'm the town centre manager here. Uh, yes. So, I work for the Papakura Business Association. Oh, that's what I like to hear. Give me one of these. Give me one of these. Business Association. Yeah. So, so what? Did you put this on today? Yes, we did. With the Papakura okay. Local what board. is what is your aims and objectives though in doing this today? What it is about today is we want a fabulous family fun day. Yeah. We want people to come and join our town. Yeah, bring it on. Give me one of these, honey. Bring it on. All of that. So it's all about keeping it family friendly. Family friendly. <laughs> Kia ora, man. And uh, right, okay. Where do you see Papakura being in the next two to five years? Two to five years? Well, Papakura is down as a metropolitan city yes. in the Auckland Unitary Plan. So it is just wow, that's to awesome. grow and stretch. Okay, now, why would somebody like you want to come here? <laughs> Oh, that's what I like to hear. Community that's what my spirit. viewers want to hear. Community. Community. Spirit. Amazing town. Kotahi tanga. Hey look, love you. Kikaha. Kikaha. I enjoy it today. Good on you. Kawai to ignore your name? John. John. Okay, John. What is your vision for this township or city I should say of Auckland? Well, one of the major things is that, you know, right now, Auckland's being planned as a city. Yes. It's not really a city, it's a region. So ah, regions, now give me one of these. Now, this is interesting. Yeah. Yep, yeah, yeah, bring so, it on. So when you plan regions, you have to plan areas differently. You know? Aha. Uh -huh. Look, people, people, are, people are needing to work, right? Yep. Work's taking them two hours in the morning to get there, two hours to go home. That's not a way of life. That's not good for family. That's not good for people. So okay. when you're in a region, you build multiple areas where you increase work so that people are closer to where they work. Yes. You know, there's a lot of families down here in South Auckland that they can't go to work because they have to take care of the kids. So maybe the husband or the wife goes to work, one person stays at home. Right. Yet it's not enough. They can't afford to live. Yes. So work has to be brought to different communities. And that's what you have to do. So you build satellite cities. You build CBD areas in multiple areas. Okay. So that people can work and be happy. I'm going to ask you a question. Do you believe that our township planning needs to be child friendly? Of course. Bring me one of these. Always. So would it be true then that we need to make our townships fun places for children? Absolutely. Eh? Are, we, are we on that? But, okay, I'm going to say this. Would it be true that they need to be a safe place for our children? Of course. Of course. Of course. We have such a huge population growth happening in Auckland. Yes. So, but we're trying to retrofit everything. Okay. But, but if you take a new area and you build a brand new modern city that has all those things that you want in it. Yeah. 
Well, you're going to have the population growth anyway. You might as well put them there and yeah, okay. build all that stuff. Okay. While you're fixing the other Okay, areas. now you're saying the right words, but have you got the right attitude and heart? Oh, <laughs> Give me one of these, because yeah. that's what my viewers are going to be wondering. Of course. Are you going to be a, a man for the people? For the people. Are you going to be a man for the community? Absolutely. Are you looking at the interest of where these people can go? And, and uh, like you mentioned about incomes, you know, rents are going up. It's a right. struggle out there. You know, and, and all this was caused by our, our council. Yeah. You know, the price of housing, the rents, all that stuff was caused by council. Right. They don't understand it. They don't understand that they caused it. You know, I used to have a business down here. Yeah. I had a restaurant just here in Takanini. Okay. And that's where I learned a lot about the people down here. People are struggling here. You know, they, they you got it. You, you, you can't just ignore these areas. Okay. Now, another thing is, John, it's like this. The bandwidth that they're interested in is whether you care. You know that, eh? Of course. That's what really matters. Okay, now, fill us in. Do you want to be the next mayor of Auckland? Yes, I do. Give me one of these. Did you hear that? You heard it on Smiley Campaign. <laughs> okay. Awesome. Kick out. I like your spirit. Thanks.